Team, it was a difficult afternoon for the boys taking the lead twice and, and then just coming away with a point. How are you feeling after that result? Yeah, of course, disappointed. Uh, I think uh, we had, especially the first half, we were really dominant and well, then we let them come into the game and uh, like you said, yeah, we went front two times, so, so of course we should have got three points here today. Yeah, and, and you, you said obviously the, the first half went, went particularly well and now got that goal and, and you went into the break 1-0 up. Um, what, what do you think changed in the second half to, to allow them back into the game? Yeah, it's hard to say. We knew they are strong in, in set pieces and yeah, they scored straight away after we came back and it was kind of a shock for us, you could say, and uh, then that we couldn't get our game straight away back. And but still, still, uh, it was an even game, and then we went in front, so so we should have kept kept the lead. Yeah, and and you got that goal in the second half to to bring the team back into the game. How did that feel in front of all of the um, away fans? Yeah, of course it felt good. Uh, also, I'm not so used to score with my head, so I was I was happy about that. But but yeah. Still, uh, we didn't get the point, so so can't be happy. Yeah, and it was quite soon after that, wasn't it, that they took it down the other end and got the equaliser. At, at that point, did, did everybody's sort of hearts drop, or did you all know that you could keep going and, and, and get something from the game? Yeah, I think we still believed we could uh, score, and we, we after that goal, I think it was just us attacking. Uh, they trying to defend, and uh, yeah, but we couldn't create anything big, big chances. They were quite low, so it was hard. Hard for us today to 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 play play in our top level. But once again, a, a real sort of team effort, and, and you showed even until those sort of final minutes, you were all sort of up here attacking together, really working hard together. So what, whatever the performance, you always do it as a t together as a team, don't you? Yeah, yeah, we are one team. We're doing it together, and yeah, and in the end, it's everything is still in our hand, and uh, we just need to start focusing on on Saturday, and there's a big game, and and. And we need to, to step up and play 90 minutes of an our best level and we will win that. Yeah, and obviously two games to go now, one of those at home on Saturday. Um, more crucial than ever now that we get those points. We can see at the end of the game here, you know, a few of the lads were sort of on the floor. It really looked like it, it sort of affected the boys today. Yeah, I think it did. Uh, but, but in the end, like I said, it's everything is in our hand and uh, we just need to start focusing to the next game as soon as possible, I think. Today, yeah, you can be a bit sad about it, but then, then just forget it and and, uh, and all focus on, on Saturday. Yeah, and, and obviously going back into that game, we're back at home with our with our crowd. We know we've got 27,000 people on our side there. That must be a good feeling knowing we've got that to come. Yeah, it, it is. It is, and uh, yeah, it's for last home game, so I think we have. We have to give give something for for our our home crowd. They've been amazing this season, so so I think it's about the time to to win again. Yeah, and 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 what what is the what is the feeling like among the dressing room now? Is there is there a sort of any nerves, or is everybody still stuck together, fighting, and and wants to see this sort of us get this over the line? Yeah, of course we we all want to go over the line, and and there's no reason to be nervous now. We are still number one, and and everything is in our hands. So so now just. Forget this and, and we keep moving forward. And just finally, a, a word again for our, not only our travelling fans, but as well as the 3,000 we had here, we had 6,000 back at Carrow Road watching the game on a beam back. Um, and it looked like it was quite a special atmosphere there as well. So it must feel great for you boys knowing you've, you've got that support behind you. Yeah, it does, yeah. They've been great for us the whole season and, uh, and it's been a nice journey so far. So, so now we just need to. To, to make it a big big party on, on Saturday and let's win that game.